Ever wondered why Hive services are a big deal in the world of big data? As we navigate the digital age, the relevance of big data is growing at an unprecedented rate. Every click, every search, every digital interaction generates data, and this data is massive, complex, and incredibly valuable for insights and decision-making. Enter Hive, a powerful tool that plays a pivotal role in managing and processing this avalanche of information. Hive services simplify big data operations, making the task of handling and interpreting large volumes of data more accessible and less daunting. It provides a platform where data can be queried and analyzed, breaking down the complexity of big data into manageable, understandable pieces. Hive services have proven indispensable in various fields from business intelligence to scientific research, acting as the bridge between raw data and meaningful insights. So Hive services are not just a trend but a necessity in the realm of big data. Now that we know the why, it's time to delve into the what of Hive services. To begin with, Hive services are a set of applications that provide the infrastructure for data warehousing and querying using the SQL-like language, HiveQL. These services allow users to interact with the Hive system, execute queries, and manage metadata. One of the key features of Hive that makes it suitable for big data operations is its ability to handle large data sets stored in distributed storage. It provides an interface to map and reduce functions, which are vital in processing vast amounts of data. Moreover, Hive supports various data formats, including structured and semi-structured data, which further enhances its versatility. Let's break down the different Hive services. First, we have Hive Server 2, a service that allows clients to execute queries and retrieve results. This service is crucial as it provides a robust, secure, and multi-user environment for running Hive queries. Next is the Metastore, an essential Hive service that stores metadata for Hive tables and partitions in a relational database. The Metastore service makes Hive a self-describing data warehouse, as it contains information about the data types, column names, and other vital details about your data. Lastly, we have Webcat a web-based service that provides a RESTful API for H-Catalog, a table and storage management layer for Hadoop. Webcat allows users to run Hive queries and MapReduce jobs via HTTP, making it more accessible to users unfamiliar with the command line. Each of these services plays a unique role in ensuring Hive's efficiency and effectiveness in handling big data. Hive Server 2 ensures secure query execution, Metastore maintains crucial metadata, and Webcat provides an accessible interface for interacting with Hadoop. Hive services, therefore, are the gears that keep the big data machinery running smoothly. They enable the processing, management, and analysis of large data sets, making Hive an indispensable tool in the world of big data. Having understood Hive services, the next step is learning how to use them. To start with, let's discuss the prerequisites for using Hive services. You need to have Hadoop and Hive installed on your system. You also need Java, as Hive is a Java-based tool. If you're not sure about the installation process, there are many online tutorials available that can guide you through it. Once you have all the necessary software, the next step is to start Hive services. You can do this by opening the command prompt and typing Hive. If everything is set up correctly, you should see the Hive command line interface. Now let's talk about executing queries using Hive. In the Hive command line interface, you can execute queries in the same way you would in SQL. For instance, you can use select to retrieve data, insert to add data, and update to modify existing data. Remember, Hive is designed to handle big data so you can perform these operations on massive data sets without any issues. One important point to remember is that Hive queries are converted into MapReduce jobs, which are then executed in the Hadoop environment. This means that while the syntax might be similar to SQL, the underlying execution is quite different and tailored for big data processing. With these steps, one can effectively utilize Hive services for big data operations. Before we wrap up, let's quickly run through the key points we've discussed. The importance of Hive services in big data cannot be overstated. They allow for efficient, flexible data querying and analysis. We've unpacked the different Hive services, each with their unique role in managing and manipulating big data. And we've also covered the steps to utilize these services, making big data more accessible and manageable. And that, in a nutshell, is the significance and utility of Hive services in big data. 
Remember, in the world of big data, Hive services are your best friend.